Terrell Davis had been in a couple parades before. It's been a while. Perhaps you were there. It was following Super Bowl 32 and 33. This morning, TD had another parade. This time, he was able to bring his loved ones along for the ride. I've been in the the uh, the Super Bowl MVP parade, the Super Bowl championship parade, this parade. Yeah, so that's about three parades. That means God is good, man. God is good. That's what that means. The parade's gonna be kind of long. It's so cool. We're exhausted, but it's so cool, so it just makes it all worth it. We're excited. Yeah, that's the best part about it. Now the family can actually experience this with me. I think that's the best part about this. They've, uh, they, you know, they like the parades, and now it's the first time they can actually be in one. So this is something they'll remember forever. So much fun. I almost want to cry. It's amazing. Good morning. Oh, it's like Christmas and all those holidays rolled up in one. This is the only time it's going to happen. This is the last time we're going to be in a, in a parade. That was Neil Schwartz, Terrell's agent, who was sitting next to him on the parade route. You also heard from his wife, Tamiko, talk about how busy they've been, and it has been that way. It wraps up tonight with Terrell giving a speech on that stage. He'll receive his bronze bust. The Broncos plane, by the way, has landed here in Canton. John Elway, Joe Ellis, they'll be here to hear what TD has to say. We'll all be interested to hear Terrell Davis's parting words on his way into football immortality. From the Tom Benson Hall of Fame Stadium, Mike Kliss, Nine News.